Hey dudes, what's going on? Here's another achievement video I'm throwing at you. This is how to get the Tower of Babel achievement and do the mass Maxis Easter Egg in Zombies Transit Mode. The achievement description says obey the voices. This is how this is one of the two ways I believe you can obey the voices. First thing you're gonna want to do is turn on the power, and then you're gonna wait till he's he's done talking, and then you're gonna be able to turn the power off. I'm gonna let you guys listen to this for right now. Okay, so he says you can shut down the power, and you're going to turn off the power, and you're going to move on. Next, you're going to want to collect pieces to the table. To build the table, it requires a radio, a fuse box, a rock, and a plank. I showed you the first spot for the radio. The second spot where you're going to be able to find the radio is in Nocturne Toten. And it should be on this little place right there I showed you in that video where, I, where it was slow. And you're going to come after you get the piece, you're going to come all the way back here and this is through the cornfield in between the farm and the power room and you're going to build it. You're just going to hold X right there and it's going to add the piece. Next you're going to get the fuse box. The fuse box is either going to be in this corner right here, this is in town, or you're going to be able to find it in a farm and it'll be hanging on the wall next to the fridge right here. It's not in the video but it, it spawns in one of two spots. Every item has two spots it could spawn in, except the rock is always in the same spot. So you're going to come back to the cornfield once again and add this piece. And then I'm going to show you guys where to find the rock. The rock's usually the first piece you get, but in this video I got it done the third. So you're going to come over here. You're going to have to crouch and pick it up from right there. And then you're going to come back to the cornfield and add the rock once again, just like you're doing. So this is the Maxis Easter egg. There's another easter egg for Richthofen and uh, I don't think I think you get the achievement for doing either one but this is definitely the easier of the two this requires either two people or four people so I'm going to show you guys how to do it both ways and this now we're going for the plank the plank can be on the ground right here which is where I found it in theater mode it bugs up and doesn't really show you or it can be here by the M16 in the tunnel if it's uh, it's going to be in one of those two places, then this is the last piece I'm adding right here. Next, you're going to go grab some EMPs. You definitely need EMPs for this glitch. I think only one person needs them, but in this video, both me and my friend, we're doing two-player method here, and we both get it. I got it first random right there. I'm pretty lucky. <laughs> and then you're going to grab turbines and come back to the cornfield where the table's at. And when there's a storm above your head, as you can see right there, you're going to kill the last zombie to start the next round. And that's what triggers the electric zombie or the him zombie to spawn. I also was told his name's Avocado. I'm not really sure if that's confirmed or not, but he's going to spawn and you're going to try and bait him underneath this tower. So you're going to want to move we we took a little while and we were strafing side to side you want to strafe side to side so you don't get hit he can kill you in almost one hit and you won't be able to have perks for this glitch or for this easter egg unless you do the perk glitch so you can do the perk glitch here and you'll be able to get perks but as you can see we're doing this at round four i believe the, zom the electric zombie will not spawn before round four so don't waste your time with it once he's underneath the tower you're going to place you and your friend are each going to place a turbine under the tower and then you're going to throw emp grenades at him to kill him i believe it only requires one emp grenade but here i threw it we threw i believe we threw three all together just in case so in four player what you're going to do is you're going to have the other two players you're going to have two players under the pylon tower and the other two players are going to be here at the bus depot and at the diner in two player you're going to do the tower of babel for the pylon and then you're going to come after you do the pylon he, he tells you good but you need more power you're going to send one person to the bus depot and the other one's going to come here to the diner and place them at these two places where the denizens can go to create the teleporters and when you're done you it'll say achievement achievement unlocked and they'll shoot red beams theater mode it kind of messes up but uh it actually looks really cool in game and you get the achievement tower of babel so that's it guys subscribe to my channel like the video and peace